He comes here to the water tank most evenings at sundown. This old coyote is very easy to recognize. One ear looks like something bit a chunk out of it. And he is more rufous colored than most coyotes. It's real dry in this country. And in the driest season, the little springs back up in the hills dry up. In my water tank, with its deep well pumping into it, is the only place animals can drink. I've seen deer drinking right beside the few cattle I still run on this dry range. I admire this old coyote. You might even say I love him. Although some of the other cattlemen out here wouldn't like to hear me say that. They think that anything that ain't cattle should be killed. I'm an old man now. I started this place a half century ago. Some people around here laughed at me. They said this land was too rocky, too dry. I felt there was water under the ground and I was right. I like to see this old coyote put his front paws up on the side of the tank and drink. See him look all around every few seconds, ever wary. That's why he's still alive at such a great age. I've watched him seem to appear from nowhere. I know I am like him, an old survivor in a dry land, ever watchful, only fighting when forced to, keeping my distance from entrapment and strife. As I stand here next to an old cedar, I know he sees me. As long as I don't come any closer than about 50 feet, he tolerates me. He knows me. I'm sure he wouldn't let anyone else get that close. I know that one of these days he won't be coming anymore. Or I won't. Until then, I'll keep coming here to the water tank at sunset. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel right.